Hi everyone. Um, I'm here to do a, a D stash video. Um, this is a little bit um, different from anything I've done before. This lot will come in a flat rate, um, medium sized box, and um, it's US and PayPal friends and family only. And I'm charging $17.10, which is exactly the cost of shipping. These items were um, gifted to me by a friend of mine whose um, sister was a, um, a stamper, crafter, and um, she passed away. So um, slowly she's been um, going through her things and um, sharing them with me, which is just very kind. And I kept some things, but um, many of the things I wouldn't use, so I want to pass them along. And... Um, so I did not know her sister. Um, I um, So I don't know if she was a pet owner. I believe she was a smoker. Um, none of these things smell like it, but um, in the past I've received some paper items that I didn't keep because they smelled of smoke. The stamps that I've received, I've always been able to keep and they've been fine. So I just want to put that out there. Um, the sta As far as the stamps go... Um, the clear and the um, the um, unmounted rubber, many of them are brand new, never been used. The wood-mounted ones um, are in a range of conditions. I mean, some of them are brand new and they still are on the harder side, but many of them are not. So I'm sending it them as is, and that will you know be for you to decide. I know in my experience, I have stamps that were mine I've, that I purchased only and have never had anybody use that over the years have gotten a little bit on the harder side and I still use them, um, although it's not preferable I, and I wouldn't choose to, um, you know, purchase a bunch of stamps that way. As I said, these wood mounted stamps, some of them are perfectly um, soft and some of them are moderately and some of them are on the harder side. So... Um, you know, that, <clears throat> that will be up to you if you, um, if you're okay with that and giving it a try. Again, I'm only charging the cost of shipping. If this lot doesn't sell, I will be, um, passing it along to, um, uh, an art reuse or something like that. But I thought that I would offer it on my channel, um, that there might be people that are interested in some of these vintage items. So let's get started with the items. I'm not going to go through every little stamp, but um, I'll just, um, with the wood mounted, there are a number of sentiment stamps that are about friendship. Um, there, this one is perfectly soft and it looks like it's never been used from Inca Dinka Do. This one, it, there are about three or four from the company Versus. And um, this one has never been used, but it's it's not hard, but it's not it's not as soft as that one. So Interestingly enough, same company, and she didn't use either of them. This one is in fine shape, also never used about friendship. Um, this is an Eleanor Rosenfeld quote. This one is from Stamp Abilities, and it's it's fine. It's not it's not completely soft, but it's it's fine and brand new, never been used. Um, this is a graph graphite stamp. Never heard of them. Looks like she did use this, and this is a piece stamp. Uh, this is Stampin' Up. This one is a little bit on the little bit on the firmer side. Again, never used um, about stamping. Uh, oops. This is Inka Dinka Do. This one's perfectly soft. When I care enough, I make it myself. Friends are angels here on earth. This one is perfectly soft, and that is from Rubber Stampede. Um, then this one is from PSX, to teach is to touch someone's life forever. That one is also pretty soft. This is pretty soft. It's an old Stampin' Up. This one is also pretty soft. It says queen of everything, and that does, it's on, it doesn't have a brand on it. There's this tie stamp. This one is a little, on the little bit on the harder side. And this one is from Parked on Rubber from Longwood, Florida. But I believe these things would still stamp, so I think it's worth a try. This is a brand new, unused Hero Arts. These geometrics, they're on the harder side. But again, brand new, I think they're worth giving them a try. Um, this is perfectly soft. Inka Dinka Do. Uh, 
sent my sentiments exactly. A little bit on the hard side, but never been used. Sympathy stamp. This is a Crafty Individuals, and this is in perfectly good shape. It looks like she has used it, but perfectly good shape. Friendship is founded on love and tr trust. Trust you are loved. This one is a little bit harder. This is Versus. This is a brand new, never been used Hero Arts stamp. A little bit hard, but never been used. I think it's worth a try. I own this stamp, so otherwise I would keep it. A peace stamp. So again, I'm, I'm letting you know that some of these are a little bit firmer than you might want, but I believe they would stamp. Stampin' Up. This is a Blessings from Stampendous in perfectly good shape. Stamp Your Art Out from Stampin' Up, also soft. Just a little note, soft. So anyway, those are those. And then this is a, um, some kind of scene um, unmounted. Then as far then there's these unmounted stamps, which are a variety of different ones. Uh, a little bit of bling and some stickers. This um, never been used uh, from Little Yellow Bicycle, an envelope album kit, which she got in 2010. And the reason I know is we shopped at a, a local art store that is no longer in business, and this is their tag. And it cost $10.10 when she bought it in 2010. She never used it. Uh, this is a, um, <clears throat> looks like unused clear stamp from, um, I think this is, uh, Crafty Secrets, yeah, Crafty Secrets, so this is Photo Palmer, yeah, made in the U.S., so this is a Photo Palmer set, which is a Thanksgiving set, never been used. There are two, um, never been used, um, red rubber uh, stamp sets from Cornish Heritage Farms, which is no longer in business. And this one is called A Royal Birthday, to, uh, 2010. And this one is called Seen It, which is also Cornish Heritage Farms, never been used. Then some of these are not photopolymer. This is a uh, never been used sentiment stamp about uh, make a wish, happy birthday, so a birthday kind of set. And this is... Another one about travel, I think, and it does not, um, this one is from Fiskar, so that is not photopolymer. This one I know, because I own it myself, is a build a um, tree stamp set from Inca Dinka Do. It's not, let me see if you can see it a little bit, oops, a little bit better, um, like this. It's not photopolymer, but it stamps perfectly fine. Um, I mean, I prefer photopolymer, but it was a cute set, so I did purchase it many years ago, and it's a cute set. It, um, you can build a tree, and there's a little bird house, and a little bird's nest, and so that one. And then this is also not photopolymer. This is uh, a cupcake set. And then finally, um, there is this large Gina K from 2010, never been used, called Enjoy the Sunshine. Uh, a stamp kit with a variety of stamps on it and sentiments. So, again, U.S. and PayPal friends and family, I'm asking $17.10, which um, as of today is the cost of um, a flat rate a medium box. Uh, I know the post office is raising their rates, but um, I don't know what that would be, and I hope that this will um, sell before they raise them. So if you're interested, leave your PayPal address in the in the comment section and I will send you an invoice. Thanks for watching.